Crazy baby, crazy, crazy, crazy. I look so crazy. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well. I am absolutely fine. Enjoying every moment of quarantine here in the household, eating. The only place I visit these days is my pantry. Open the drawer, check out the stuff, pull a bag of chips, and then close it. And back to my couch with my Netflix and my bag of chips. And that is my life. And after a very long time, however, today I tried uh, straightening my hair. How does it look? Do you guys like it? Not like it? Mm -hmm. Do you like the curls? Do you like the straightened hair? However, so I was just decluttering my um, PR drawer and I found this. Yay! Yippee! And somehow I missed filming it. Colourpop. I hope you guys are listening. I love you a lot. Mwah. I'm sure you guys have seen a zillion of reviews over YouTube, but that's my take. This will be my take, so, yeah. So this is uh, the box that Colourpop has sent me with all their goodies. I have already done my brows. I'm just gonna set this hair in place because it keeps disturbing me and I definitely do not want to get disturbed. Let's begin. So the first thing that I see here is this a face milk, coconut face milk the good stuff of course hashtag face milk and it has coconut milk coconut oil marshmallow root and aloe vera oh my god all i'm gonna do is just shake it real well get a dollop around my face and go with my clean hands and start moisturizing oh yeah love the smell it really smells divine it smells like coconut it's so hydrating so moisturizing what does it say hmm apply two to three drops in your palm warm them between hands and gently press into the skin use as needed that is not what i did but but work in the way whatever works for you this is your gem you do your thing after the face milk, we do have a lip balm and a lip scrub. So, oh, how cute! The lip balm is white in color. And I love white. Exactly. The one that I had before in strawberry, the same thing in coconut. And I'm just going to try it on just a little bit just to see how it feels. Mmm, coconut. Exactly. Right, so now that my lips is nicely scrubbed and exfoliated, I'm gonna go in with the lip balm. Uh, so this is the eyeshadow palette, uh, which is called Going Coconuts. And of course, I am going coconuts, no doubt about it. And along with it, I do have two pressed powder slash bronzer you can use it as a contour bronzing etc etc raw etc means end of a thinking capacity but now more to come yes of course one of them is called talk to the palm talk to the palm honey talk to the palm and the other one is called coconut beach of course i'm going to open the packaging and show it to you guys but before that let's go on with the eyeshadow palette which i'm so excited to try and look how cute it looks oh my god do you see the shades oh like the best moment of my life and i open an eyeshadow palette and i'm like yeah first things first i am quickly off camera gonna set my lid so the first one that i'm gonna use is called the shredded i'm just gonna take that dab the excess and start applying okay this is a more of a base color for me rather than a transition color this will be more of a base color for me 
So uh, the next shade that I'm gonna take is uh, this cool toned brown. It's called yeah, Culotta. So I'm gonna take that shade and work it on my crease with a fluffy brush. This is a, such a pretty color. It's turning out to be that color that I thought it it would be. I somehow love cool toned brown. Flip the brush with the other end, get inside, and start um, blending it. Next, I'm gonna take another brush and the color Shell Yeah, which was the warm brown. And I'm just gonna pack it in the outer corner of the eyes. I'm just gonna bring it all the way up. A clean a blending brush and a blend everything in place. Now that the blending is done, I'm gonna go in with the shade called Lovely Bunch. Just a little bit of that color and pack it on the crease. Next, I'm just gonna go back with the blending brush and I blend it all out again. I'm gonna go with this Coco Rush. It is so calling my name. I'm just gonna go with this color, that metallic color in the middle. I'm just gonna go with it. Next, with this clean uh, blending brush, I'm just gonna blend the edges and make it look nice and even. Right, now to deepen up the crease a little more, I am going to go with the color Shell Yeah and take the clean blending brush again and just buff it all in. Take uh, that palm reader with white, some fix plus, of course. I'm just gonna pack it ever so lightly. You know what? It's not working, so I'm just gonna go with my finger. That's all, I'm all set. Now for the lower lash line, what I'm gonna do, a brush like so. This cool tone brown again, it's called Coolara. So now uh, what I'm gonna do is I am gonna clean off the edges, put on my base, put on the foundation, concealer, blah, 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 do the shit and get back to you guys with some falsies. See ya. So mascaras on uh, my lashes along with the falsies. And of course, tighten the upper uh, lash line um, by using some cold pencil. And uh, that's about it. I'm gonna keep this look here. Now let's uh, move on to the face contouring. These are two pressed powder. It's also called is pressed proud powder bronzer. Can I pronounce it? Blah, blah, blah pressed powder bronzer that is what it is called so the first shade is called coconut beach and i'm so intrigued to try that on Ooh, this is how the shade looks i'm so happy right, let me show you how the other shade looks though it's called talk to the palm well honestly i might be blind but i do not see much of a difference in these two colors i would say one of course have a little pinky like this one uh, which is called talk to my palm has a little more pink in it and the other one is a little more brown so that is what i would say the basic difference is and now all i'm gonna do is just get some bronzer on I 
I went ahead and applied uh, the bronzer. Love the way my cheeks look and also a little bit of a blush just to give a little color because I felt I was looking very, very, very pale. Moving on, the next thing that they had sent me was uh, this a uh, pack. So these are uh, the three press super sharp uh, shadows that I received. The first one is called Deep Dive. Peekaboo, Ooh, I love the name. And the last one is a little quirky. So I'm very excited to try Peekaboo. I think I'm gonna use this color, Peekaboo, as a highlighter because hell yeah, I need a highlighter right now. I need, do not see a highlighter in here. So I'm definitely gonna use this. I feel like doing a GIF all by myself. Oh my god, oh my god. Am I alive? Is it like... Just apply a little bit at the bridge of my nose. Not too much, just to make it on top a little bit. Maybe a little bit at the pointy tip, if I might call, because I do not have a sharp nose, but yep. Yeah, and a little bit at the bridge. Perfect. And now I'm gonna take the same super sharp shadow as a highlighter and apply it on my cupid's brows. So lovely. So now I'm gonna go on with the lips for lip crayons. These are four colors. Maybe I'm going to use this nude bleach because hell yeah, I'm going for the nude look today, so why not nude bleach? Let me try, let me go on with the other nude nude, like the brown nude that was there. This is uh, the final look. Hope you guys liked it. I loved it. And do not forget to hit the like button and do subscribe and keep sharing the love and comments. I love you guys. Mwah, mwah, mwah.